Hello everyone, welcome back. Welcome back to another video of my channel. I am Kishal. I hope you all are doing well. Welcome back to another placement statistics video of my channel. And as you know from the thumbnail that in this video we are going to talk about IIT Bombay MTech CAC placement. So as you know that in all the Indian institutions, top IITs and IISC, in December the placement is you know happening. And in this series of videos that I am preparing in this month, I have covered that how placement is happening in different institutions. And specifically, I talked about that how placement has happened in ISC Bangalore, IIT Kharagpur, IIT Madras, IIT Hyderabad, Triple IIT Hyderabad, and the last video was about IIT Kanpur. So there is a playlist dedicatedly for these series of placement statistics. So if you haven't watched those videos, the link of the playlist I'll be giving in the description. It might come in the I button. You can go and check it out. Now coming back to this video, in this video I'll talk about how placement has happened for MTech CSE student at IIT Bombay. In specific, I'll be talking about which of the companies has reached the campus, whether they have taken any MTech student or not. If they have taken any MTech student, how many students they have taken. What are the job roles that they offered and finally what was the base salary and CPU salary. So all details will be there in this particular video. So if you want to know detail about how placement has happened for MTech CSE student in IIT Bombay, please stay tuned to this video till end. And before starting the video, as I always say that if you like this video, don't forget to hit the like button and share this video to other people. And if you are new to this particular channel, please subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon so that you get all the notifications regularly. Without further delay, let's start into today's video. There is a good news for all my subscribers who are Hindi speaking. Now you can listen to my videos in Hindi dub version. Just follow karo these simple steps. Welcome back. Welcome back to another video of my channel. I am Kishal. I hope you all are doing well. Welcome back to another placement update video of my channel. You are welcome. In my last video, I talked about IC Bangalore and I have told you how the placement of IC Bangalore in this year in 2024 has been updated. These are simple steps to follow and you can listen to my videos in Hindi and in the Hindi Dev version. So just relax and enjoy the content. Okay, so let's get into the data for placement statistics at IIT Bombay in MTX PSC directly. The first company who is a V to the campus was Google. They have taken one student. The role that they offered was software engineering role. The base salary was 21 LPA and the CTC was 39 LPA. Next is Microsoft. Unfortunately, Microsoft hasn't taken any MTech CSE student from IIT Bombay. Uh, they have most probably taken students from other departments, MTech students, or maybe from the BTech students majority they have taken. The role that they're offering was software engineering. The base salary was 15 LPA and CTC was 31 LPA. Next was Qualcomm. Qualcomm has taken three or four students. The role that they offered was both uh, ML engineer or data scientist role and system level software engineering role. The base salary was 19 LPA and CTC was 42 LPA. Flipkart has been to the campus, but again, Flipkart haven't taken any student from MTech CAC. The role that they offered for MTech CAC student was data scientist. Base salary was 22 LPA and CTC was 27 LPA. Mintra, uh, Mintra, haven't, uh, Mintra has been to the campus for the data scientist role, but they didn't allow any MTech CAC student to participate in the interview. Most of the cases, most of the time, they have taken BTech CAC and BTech other department students to uh, participate for the interview in the data scientist role. Uh, so that's why they haven't taken any MTech CAC student as well. Next is Oracle. Oracle has taken five students for the software development role. Base salary was 18.28 LPA and CTC was 35 LPA. Next was Taiwan Semiconductor. Uh, so they have shortlisted one or two students from MTech CAC, but they haven't selected anyone. Mostly they have taken students from other department and BTech students preferably they have taken. The CTC that they are offering was 60,000 to 70,000 USD. Uh, so this is an international offer, most probably in Taiwan. Uh, so that's why the CTC is this much. I mean 60,000 to 70,000 USD is a huge amount. Meso, uh, Meso also, you know, initially they haven't shortlisted any MTech CSE student. Only BTech CSE student they have shortlisted. Uh, but later they have shortlisted few MTech students for working interviews. So in IIT Bombay, there is a concept called working interviews. And suppose in some company, you know, initially they didn't select a uh, student from some discipline, but they are, you know, the number of vacancies is not fulfilled, then they can go for working interviews. And there they have shortlisted MTech uh, uh, CSE student. But finally, they didn't select anyone. 
Now, DSO has taken uh, two students for software engineering role. The base salary was 34 LPA and CTC was 51 LPA. Next is NVIDIA. NVIDIA has taken two students for software engineering role. The base was 19 LPA and CTC was 36.6 LPA. Next is Ola. Ola have taken one or two students. The base salary was 31.8 LPA and CTC was 35 LPA. Next, Apple. Apple has taken one student. Base was 22 LPA and CTC was 36 LPA. Next is Texas Instrument. They have taken three or four students uh, for embedded software engineering role. The base salary was 20 LPA and CTC was 33 LPA. Uh, so as I already mentioned for in, in my IIT Kanpur video that this Texas Instrument is a system level uh, company. So that's why uh, they have provided this embedded software engineering role. And mostly the people who are working in architecture or operating system or embedded system, they will be best suited for this job role. Next is Sony Japan. Sony Japan uh, has visited the campus and it was an international offer. Uh, the CTC was 61.8. 200 lakhs yen uh, so most likely the job location was japan but you know they haven't taken any mtech csc student uh, similarly honda r d they have shortlisted many mtech csc student but probably they have taken one student from mtech csc it is also an international offer uh, the ctc was 78 to 88 lakhs per per annum uh, yen next is fujitsu fujitsu base salary was 23 lp and ctc was 28 lp they haven't also selected any mtech CAC student next is samsung research they have taken uh, many students samsung research for bangalore branch has taken four students for delhi they have taken four students and for noida they have taken three students the base salary was 17.5 lp and ctc was 24.5 lp next is dream 11 dream 11 has come for data scientist role they have taken two students Next, SAP Lab for cloud engineering role, they have taken three students. MathWorks, uh, they have taken uh, as software development engineer four for technical role three and embedded software engineering two. Micron has taken two students. Next is Cerebras, they have taken two students. MindGate has taken one student and TCS Research has taken one student. Uh, Hero Motocops has taken two students for software developer engineer. Oxia has taken three students. Uh, Hakimo AI has taken four students. Uh, the role that they offered was front end uh, developer, back end developer, and software developer. Finally, there was a trading few trading company was there like IMC Trading and Algo Quant. These are trading company or uh, they are recruiting for Quant role. They are shortlisted one or two students for MTech CSE, but finally none of the MTech CSE student got placed. The role was software developer engineer. Uh, and the requirement was, uh, you know, that they were testing in the in the interview round was very hard lead code, uh, code. So if you're able to uh, do very hard lead code, then only you'll be able to select in this in this in these companies. So this is kind of the overall data. And approximately when I have gathered this information uh, about this placement statistics, 80 students of MTech CSE IIT Bombay got placed. Out of to out of approximately ninety plus students actually appeared for the placement uh, placement session this year. Now, what are the key takeaways I'm getting from the data that I've just shared with you? The first one is out of ninety plus students who have appeared for on campus placement from MTech CSE and IIT Bombay, eighty got placed. And this data I've collected in the third week of December. That means within three weeks, almost ninety percent students got placed. That's a great thing. The second takeaway is all the big names have visited the campus. Google was there, Apple was there, Microsoft, Flipkart, Ola, Nvidia, Samsung Research. So all the big names, even uh, there was international offer like Sony was there, Honda R&D, Taiwan Semiconductor. So big names have visited the campus. Now, you know, it's up to the students whether they perform well or not. Like Microsoft haven't taken any MTech CC student most probably. So probably, you know, they didn't find any suitable candidate and they found that BTEC students are more capable of joining the job. So that's that's why you know they haven't taken any students so it's up to the students the mtech students how they'll perform in the interview based on that that they'll be selected for a particular company or not but overall you know if the big companies are coming from institute perspective or from the placement sale perspective they are doing great job and they are able to bring the big names and they are giving the opportunity to the students to appear for the interview and then you know it's up to their performance the next is as i said international offer was there like sony r d uh, Honda R&D, Taiwan Semiconductor was there, but unfortunately, I think none of the MTech CSE student got placed in those companies. And also, trading company like uh, I, I told about the IMC Trading and some other company was there. They also shortlisted few MTech CSE students. So that means 
एम टेक्स टू सी एस सी स्टूडेंट इफ दे आर रियली गुड इन द कोडिंग दे विल भी शॉर्ट लिस्टेड फॉर दिस ट्रेडिंग कंपनी हुई इज फेमस फॉर ह्यूज पैकेजेस आई रिमेंबर लास्ट ईयर फ्रॉम आई आई टी बॉम्बे एम टेक्स सी एस सी वन स्टूडेंट गॉट प्लेस इन टू दिस ट्रेडिंग कंपनीज बट दिस ईयर आई आई फाउंड दैट नो वन गॉट प्लेस एट दो देर आर फ्यू स्टूडेंट हु गॉट शॉर्ट लिस्टेड फॉर इट सो इन आई टी बॉम्बे दैट मीन्स देर इज ए देर इज अ काइंड ऑफ कल्चर ऑफ एम टेक्स स्टूडेंट्स गोइंग फॉर ट्रेडिंग कंपनीज और इंटरनेशनल ऑफर the next is there is a mix of uh, you know job roles like you, as you can see most of the job roles are software developer though but there are few companies like flipkart has come for data scientist role i think i think mintra was for data scientist role and there are few system level role also as there like texas instrument nvidia they are offering system level role so you know there is a kind of opportunity for those students who are working in machine learning or system level role to go for data scientist though uh, the, the amount is very limited most of the job roles are software engineer and finally if you look into the packages packages are also uh, very decent kind of the traditional or conventional package that people used to get in other iits for mtech csc branch similar kind of package is being offered to mtech csc at iit bombay as well though i don't have the average or highest ctc details because there are lot of companies has with the camp of actually you know very few actually have shared with you there are many startups and many other companies are also with the campus and uh so the exact then getting the exact average salary or uh, highest salary ctc and base is bit, bit difficult but overall if you see the data you will you will understand that uh, iit bombay this year for at least for mtech csc student the placement has done really great job so yeah that's it guys that's it about this video i hope you have liked this video i hope you have gained an insight about how placement is happening in iit bombay because i know many of the gate aspirants they have this dream uh to get a single digit rank and go to iit bombay for pursuing their mtech i hope this video will give you a clear idea about that how placement is happening uh in iit bombay this year so if you have any query and comment let me know in the comment section of this video i'll try to answer them and if you have any any particular topic on which you want me to make a video that also you can write uh in 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 the comment section i'll try to you know make a video on this particular topic And if you like this video don't forget to hit the like button and share this video to other people and if you are new to this particular channel please subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon so that you get all the notifications regularly that's it about this video i'll meet you in next video until then